Okay, and here's just to give you an idea of what it sounds like. Here is the blue mic um, set to sort of podcast mode, as I'm now calling it, um, which, you know, I'm a good, what, a foot maybe away from it, probably even too close right now. And as you can see, I'm monitoring the, head, the um, live feed in my headphones right now, so I can hear what the computer's hearing, and I can turn the volume up, I can turn the gain up and down uh, to make it more gainy, more echoey, or less, depending on the... Uh, mood and obviously you want to be setting this before you start recording because you can probably hear the the clickiness of the actual dial itself i kind of like it about there i don't know why uh, but there you go um i'll probably just uh, do another setting again with a pop filter in a second just to show you that um, but that's that um i'll quickly do a stereo mode just to give you an idea which is you just click this on the back here to stereo there we are i think I'm hoping that's stereo. Yes, there we are. And so now, in theory, you should uh, you should hear me go across from the left to the right and across here again. Um, does pick up all the background noise though on the stereo. There's a guinea pig case directly behind the camera, so you can probably hear him rattling away there. Uh, we'll stick it back to podcast mode. There you go, and that gets rid of some of that feedback. So, obviously, when you do set to different modes, you do need to have a little practice of setting the thing up uh, before you start using it, because um, otherwise, you're going to pick up surrounding noise and background noise, and just just fiddle about and find the settings that are right for you. I'm going to have fun doing this myself. I'll be using this for game commentaries. So I'll be using this for pod, for podcasts as well, and pro probably for some singing as well, because uh, I've got a sister channel, Movie Music, which I've left unloved. And I'm going to make some videos for that. Um, semi regularly on there, just some karaoke covers and that kind of stuff, just to sort of, it helps, you know, singing helps, doesn't it? But anyway, so to, speaking of singing, let's stick a pop filter on this thing and uh, see what it sounds like with a pop filter on, just to give you an idea on that, and then we'll wrap this review up. So, see you in a sec. And you can even use it with a pop filter as I've got here, as I showed you earlier. This is just clipped onto the actual stand of the microphone itself. Um, and, uh, you know, best for when you're singing. Uh, anyone who sings knows that pop filters just get rid of that <laughs> kind of spitty kind of background noise that you tend to get. Um, so, yeah, I'm, I'm a bit closer to the microphone right now because of the pop filter, of course. Um, it doesn't actually affect the microphone itself. It just, uh, you know, my mouth's near the filter. That's all. But it can pick you up from quite a way away, as you can see right here. Um, so yeah, it's really good. And as you can see, I'm monitoring the um, the output live through the bottom of the microphone itself. So what the computer's hearing, I can hear in here. And I can adjust the gain accordingly with, with the knob up here uh, to make it a bit, you know, a bit more gainier or, or a bit less down here. I, I kind of like it about there, I think. Not quite decided but there we go this is set to the sort of podcast mode if you will um you have got the stereo mode as well uh, which picks up a lot more of the background noises and things um and then obviously you've got the omnidirectional stuff as well so um hopefully this gives you an idea of what it sounds like and hopefully you enjoyed this unboxing i'll do a more detailed review in the near future and uh, you can check out a related re um, video uh, by clicking the box at the end there um which um does show me singing into this thing with this kind of setup just an initial kind of test just to see what it sounds like so hopefully you enjoyed that and until next time i've been move it and you can follow me on twitter at move it and you can find all my links via in my blog which is via the link below and hope give this uh video a like and a share if you do like it and tell your friends and uh, if there's anything else you want me to review let me know via the comments as per usual until next time i'll see you later ta -ra. I like to move it, move it, bit.